Welcome back to Tom's Life. Today's Sunday special is Victoria Sponge Cake. The ingredients you need are butter, sugar, self raising flour, a splash of milk, four eggs, a pinch of salt, one lemon, jam, and cream. First step is to weigh out all the ingredients. You will need 220 grams of butter. First step to do is weigh out 220 grams of margarine. I'm using my talking scales so I know how much it is. What's on? Next step is to weigh out the self raising flour. You need 225 grams. I'm going to use my token scales again. Need to take a little bit out. Gotta take ten grams out. Next step is to weigh out the granulator sugar. You will need 225 grams. Gonna use my scales again. Just, to, just, just gonna take a little bit out. Spot on. Please heat the oven to one sixty. I'm going to switch on the oven. I'm using my bump on so I know which one is the oven. First thing to do is paste the butter and sugar together in the big mixing bowl.
could also crack your eggs into your bowl and give it a good whisk. Give it a good whisk. Give it a good whisk with your fork. Next step is to grate the lemon. for quite a few minutes when the sugar and butter falling off the spoon that's when you know it's nearly binding together and you can add your flour eggs lemon and the milk Okay, next step is to add the flour when you know it's nearly falling off the spoon like that. Now add the flour to your mixture. Slowly stir all together till it binds in. in the eggs and give it a stir stir it well but slowly If you can see I'm staying it all together but gently so you don't lose it just pat it off the spoon Next add the splash of milk and the lemon Sess Now add a pinch of salt, stay well, give it a good stir so everything comes off the sides and you will be nice and bind together. And it should look something like that when you're nearly ready to put it in the baking trays. Next step is to grease your tins with a little bit of butter and get it all around the tin. A 
next step is to now pour the mixture into the trays, evening it out into both of the trays. Now I'm just evening it out all around with the back of my spoon. Next step is to put them in the oven to cook for 25 to 30 minutes. Final step is to put the jam and cream on, on the Victoria sponge. Now spread the jam out, or go all the way to the edge. Next step is to place the squirty cream on top of the jam and the base of your Victoria sponge. Finally, put your top on the cake. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe, more videos coming soon.